，哦，好，就 OK。哎，我叫做 m a r i a g e Blue Period Episode Eleven， 耶，哇 ，So ladies and gentlemen， so last episode was a quite interesting fan service episode because we get to see some naked bonding， like oh my god， dude， those two boys being naked， enjoying themselves naked in front of a mirror， it's just a very fun sight to see indeed， man， especially the fact that Ryuji is indeed a boy because of the chest and stuff like that， but you know the face kind of you know not really buying it to be honest， but anyhow， you can say it was a really really fun episode seeing those two bonding of course and of course giving Beauty, the idea of nudism, how the, you know affects your imagery and how you draw from it, and this is hopefully that allows him to like you know do well in the second exam, which so far is not looking good right now because you know he literally fainted in the stairs, basically stress taking over his body, something like that. So let's just see how it goes for today's episode. I feel like you know it's gonna be a very painful watching for today's episode. So that said, let's get started, rushing, shall we? Well, it seems like stress and tiredness is really going the better of Yatora, man. Like, dude, not the right timing, dude. Oh, hey, yo, Mori Senpai, or is that just an illusion? Wait, no way, Mori Senpai is actually here and support her. Oh, wow, how nice of her, man. Oh, never mind, that's just an illusion. <laughs> what? How? Wait, why is so your scared, Mori? Well, off to the rescue, I guess. Haha, <laughs> nice. Now, I gotta say, she actually lifted with one hand, like, damn, girl. Well, I mean, at least Yatora made it to a classroom or just an exam hall, I guess. Wait, are we actually gonna have a nude model? Oh my god, no way. We actually gonna have a nude model? I gotta say, I really feel sorry for Yatora, man. Having a headache and while being stressed out and tired on the day of the exam, the biggest day of the exam, is the big no-no. It's like me having a headache on uh, my final exam. So, dude. You should have prepared properly, man, Yatori. You should have slept properly. You should have eaten properly. You should have rest properly. This is why a lot of teachers, you know, do, uh, before the exam, always tell the student, sleep properly, eat properly, and make sure that you rest properly so that this shit don't happen to you on the day of exam. So yeah, Yatora, you did not prepare properly, man. Yep, I knew it. It's a nude model. Oh my god, yo, it's a nude model! Oh, oh, oh. So, okay, nippleless. I see where I see you. I see you. Oh, okay. Turn him off or something. Oh, you know that eyes, man. Well, you tell him to wash his mouth. Nice. Well, it seems like she'll be taking a gap year again just to prepare for the, for the next exam. Oh, this will be her last one, too. Damn. Yeah, you can say, you know, once you've done your third attempt, then you might as well just give up, man. Like, you know, just. Give out on the dream. You got a few for her, man. She tried so hard. Yeah, that's why these people have to make it count, man. Get in the first attempt so that you won't have the stress of doing it over and over again. Like, yeah, Yatora, you are not doing yourself any favor right now. You're not even making any progress, too. Oh my god, you feel lucky? Really, man? You, you feel lucky? <laughs> Dude, this is not the time to be a perverted boy, okay? I mean, I know Yatora has this sort of like you know, a virgin in him, I guess, but I mean, I can relate to this because like, seriously though, as a, during a nude model, if you don't have a much more professional mindset, then you're just going to do this throughout the class. So, <laughs> oh my God, Yatora, focus, man, just focus. I gotta say, she got some nice abs, man. The model got some nice abs. I mean, you think about it, he did kind of prepare himself for nudism drawing, I guess, so I guess the whole nudity theme is a big part of this final exam. Dude, Yator haven't get into the whole preparedness for the drawing, too. He's just sitting by and just resting. Like, oh my god, dude. Yator is not gonna do well in this final exam. I feel like he's gonna retake it, too. And guess time's up. Oh my... You actually fell asleep throughout. Oh my god, this guy is pathetic. Well, I mean, he's making a last burst of effort, I guess. Uh, at least trying to make something count, I guess. Ah, look at him, man. Lying in bed. As I expected, anyways. Dude, you lack preparedness, Yatora. Oh my god, she went as far as calling him. Like, I mean, that's commitment as a teacher, I would say. I know, the timing is so bad, man. Like, there's a stress during the main exam is like a big no-no. 
the timing is like not in his side. Well, I mean, of course he's not gonna give up, but he, at least he came up with some sort of theme to his drawing, I guess. <laughs> oh my, not helping, man. Not helping, man. <laughs> Seriously, not helping, but at least something to let him reflect on, I guess. Oh, oh, that's a secret technique. Oh, I see. Secret technique. Oh, I see what you mean. Ah, smart. I mean, in the art exam, you can't really say you're gonna do this and that. Just don't look, you know, weird with the hat on and some, you know, salad tape on your head and, you know, take it. I mean, of course, you know, those are your ways of keeping you focused, I guess, in the end for a very long JJP exam. Okay, before I say any more, I gotta say the BGM for this scene right here. Obviously, you guys can only hear a bit of it, though. It is just one of the weirdest BGM I've been. Oh, 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 what the fuck is that? Seriously. I mean, at least you managed to get the composition drawn and, you know, at least get an idea what you're gonna draw in the main, the you know, the portrait, I guess. Oh, I go home and play Pokemon and sleep. I mean, at least you know what needs to be done. And might as well go all out. Oh, that's a good advice. Go all out, get go back and rest all you need. So that's some good advice right there. Oh, wow. Really? Really? Look at other people's drawing and get some ideas from it. Are you sure it's a good idea since it's kind of late right now? I mean, most people haven't really drawn it yet. Maybe they just get the background done first. And I mean, who else could it be that drawing such a beautiful art already? Well, I mean, seriously. Well, let's just hope Jatora really makes some progress this time since he got the secret technique to keep him going. I mean, I like the fact how he's analyzing her beautiful skin. Maybe give, give some inspiration to the lighting, I guess, to the shadowing effect. Oh, I see what he's doing. He's doing some sort of shadowing effect. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it, man. Oh, nice. I, I can see where he's going with this creativity, man. Draw around it and make sure the nude really stands out. <laughs> Wait, that's how you hold a chopstick? Like, what the hell? And look at this awkward moment between these two. <laughs> I know, right? Why? He's focusing. Well, it seems like he's choking on his own food. Help him out, Yatora. Yeah, why do you see Mori Senpai in Yasuke? I don't know, man. I feel like... I mean, I won't be surprised if he turns out to be Mori Senpai's younger brother or relative or cousin. I'm more like Smo's or younger brother anyway. So, yeah, that should be a quite interesting plot, I guess. I mean, I've seen this done many times, to be honest. I feel like Yatora gained some inspiration from that flashback, I guess. Oh my god, he actually came- Yes, Yatora, that's the mindset I want. Oh yes, he finally gained some sort of like creativeness in him now. Oh, okay, what is he doing? Yo, what? No way, what are you doing? Okay. Well, I mean, what can I say for today's episode? There's two things that we learned. One, the beauty of nudism that has many allow you to come up with some creative ways to, you know, elaborate your true self and allow you to show off your beautiful skin and how to, you know, go about to analyze the beauty of nudism indeed. But that is just basically art student mindset, to be honest. And for some regular person looking into this anime, it's just like, oh, wow, I can't many people actually like think through the process, how to like, really reflect the beauty of the body and stuff like that. I was like, wow, I can see why historically, you know, nude models are being used because like, you know, use it to like emphasize the beauty of the a person, mostly the girls, of course, and, you know, allow you to reflect on your own self and ugliness and stuff like that. So, yeah, you know, art talk and stuff like that. You do art history. This is like also a perfect anime for you to enjoy too because you get to analyze 
how artists go about to draw the drawing of course even though i find art history degree kind of like lame but yeah you can say you know it was a really good episode to see how yoto are able to like you know think through the process how to like find ways to really take his art to the next level because you know this is the final exam he fucked up the first day and he needs to find a way to bounce back of course so and then that, that's when it comes to the second part that we learned from today's episode is the fact that you need to have a proper preparedness for the exam indeed man like you saw how Yatora literally altered on the first day like literally headache stress and itchiness and most importantly can't even fucking focus and sleepy like that's why many teachers been telling us to like sleep properly eat properly and rest properly because this so that this shit won't happen in during your time in exam because like if this were to happen to me in a final exam where you can make a make a break my degree like two one two two or get into a fucking university then i rather take some break indeed i know some people like to study the night before exam and that is sometimes helpful but sometimes if you have a weak mind you can't really focus during the exam so that's why many teachers say rest properly the day before the exam so that you won't go through stress because when you're stressed out you can't think properly if you're more relaxed and you're more confident you're more you know prepared then you can do well in the exam so that's why you know Yatora fucked up on the first day because he didn't really have the proper rest even though he sleeps but he still I, I bet I bet you this during his sleep he still thinks about what to do with his drawings and stuff like that that's what that's not a proper sleep that's not a deep sleep so that's why he couldn't really do well on the first day but Thanks to the teacher with his secret, her secret technique, putting a fucking head tape or something like that, and put and wearing glasses really make the difference. I mean, for art though, it does. For for regular exam, it's just like, yeah, no, to be honest. But anyhow, I'm glad Yatora able to like you know think through the process, able to like find some creative ways to take his art to the next level because he really needed big time, of course. So I do wonder what he gonna do with the whole pouring the tubulin liquid into his paint drawer, uh, board or something maybe use it as a way to like make the, the shading more beautiful or something like that or maybe use it for some like i'll just say different distinguished color to the background drawing well we'll just see man so next episode should be the final episode yes i know guys next week is the final episode of blue period the first anime to finish the season d because it start early too so I'll be very much looking forward to see what will Yatoro do to pass these exams. So with that said, I hope you guys enjoy my reaction. Smash that like button and I'll see you guys next time.